Hello guys, welcome back to Watch Addiction Watch Reviews. Today in front of you is a watch from Ralph Christian, a brand I've reviewed before. Um, they sell a lot of uh, watches on their website. We'll drop a link in the description below. It's kind of a homage style watch. Uh, not one to one, obviously. It's a homage watch. And um, it's a pretty well made watch. Uh, the quality is very good for the money. These are under $200, depending if you get it on this bracelet or you get it on the rubber band, which I'll show you in a minute. You can always add on the bracelet as well, but you're looking at about 120, 150 bucks, uh, which is a pretty good deal. Shipping is pretty pretty fast as usual, and yeah, just overall for an overall fun watch to wear. Um, but yeah, let me show you the box, and we'll dig right into it. The box is pretty simple, which is some labeling here, and you open it up to a Ralph Christian box. Inside, you get your watch on a pad. You get your instruction and warranty. And it's just a pretty simple cardboard box, nothing too fancy there. But for the price, I think it's definitely sufficient. Now the watch itself is crafted of solid 316L stainless steel all around. There are a bunch of different finishes, mainly brushed and polished. As you can see, the bezel is uh, fully brushed, while the sides of the case are fully polished as well. As you can see here, very high polish, kind of a curved case here. Uh, very comfortable watch to wear as well. Um, but yeah, some basic specifications. Uh, with my calipers, I got about 13 millimeters thick here from top to bottom. In terms of diameter, you're looking at 44 millimeters. Um, but it definitely wears a bit smaller because you have that kind of integrated bracelet, integrated. It's not really integrated, it just kind of goes under here. Uh, 24 millimeters is this, is this bracelet, tapers all the way down to 22. Um, we get a sapphire coated mineral crystal. Uh, inside we do have a automatic movement. It's uh, hand winding and not hackable. Um, but it's fully skeletonized, which is pretty cool. It's a Japanese or Chinese automatic movement. I'm not exactly sure which caliber, um, but as you can see here, if I get you in a little closer, you can see the front of the movement. You see the balance wheel going off over here. You have two loomed hands. You have applied, polished, and faceted markers. You have the Ralph Christian logo below the 12 o'clock position. Now, one thing if you didn't notice, um, all the screws are completely aligned perfectly, which I really do appreciate. Uh, they're not all over the place. It's always nice to see. The crown is pull and push and signed with their logo as well. You get five uh, ATMs or 50 meters of water resistance. So obviously not a watch to take in the water, more of a land watch, um, something to wear uh, casually, I'd say. Um, but yeah, um, let's take a closer look at this watch. So this is the watch on the actual uh, bracelet, which is an extra add-on, or you can pay a little more. Um, it's a butterfly clasp, two buttons here, opens up to a nice butterfly clasp. You get two buttons here, pretty secure, fully polished, snaps down very nicely, and everything conforms very nicely as you can see there. Uh, fully brushed and polished on the edges. Uh, heading straight to the case back, as you can see, they have a custom signed Ralph Christian rotor on that screw down stainless steel case back. Uh, bracelet is quick release, so you can just pop that right off, change it to the rubber band there. Um, but yeah, the movement doesn't look too bad, has a lot of inner workings as you can see there. All stainless steel, water resistant 50 meters, and yeah, overall it's not a bad looking movement for the price of this uh, entire watch. Now the watch actually uh, has some nice weight to it. Um, it feels pretty good in the hand, it's not overly heavy, it's not overly empowering, but it has a nice weight to it, you will feel it on your wrist. Now this movement here, as you can see, we get the crown over here, which is definitely very usable, very positive action, give it some power. And it is already running, as you can see that smooth sweeping seconds hand. We can pull out one position, and then we can set the time here. There's no hacking, there's no hidden date or anything like that, just a very simple movement. Pull in, push out, set the time, and you're good to go. Uh, in terms of loom, like I stated earlier, there is only some green superluminova on the actual hands themselves. Um, there's no loom on the actual markers. Uh, but yeah, I mean, it's not really a dive watch or anything like that. So I wouldn't, wasn't really expecting that anyway. Now the finishing on the watch is actually really good. I was quite surprised. It's highly brushed, I mean highly polished on these sides of the watch. You're brushing over here with the two screws. Flipping to the other side of the watch, you can see it is highly polished as well. You get brushing over here, and you get brushing on the bezel as well. So I think everything kind of flows together really nicely. Uh, the bracelet's actually pretty good quality. It's held in by pins. So you will need to adjust that with your hammer and pin. Um, but yeah, um, I think overall it's a pretty decent looking watch if you want that look and you don't have a lot of money. Obviously, you know, this costs under 200 US dollars and the quality is pretty good. Um, so yeah, if you're into something like that, maybe this could be for you. 
Um, I'm going to go ahead and take off this band here and throw it on the original rubber band it came with, which is actually really comfortable. But first, let me show you how this one looks on my 6.75 inch wrist. On my 6.75 inch wrist, the watch is, uh, I would say, has a good presence to it. I definitely can pull this one off. Uh, the bracelet curves over nicely, doesn't pull hair or anything like that. It's a pretty decent quality bracelet there. Um, but yeah, lug to lug, as you can see here, it fits across, kind of curves down. Maybe a millimeter too big for my wrist. I really don't have that big of a wrist. Um, but it's definitely a nice look. Definitely looks a lot more expensive than it costs, which a lot of people do like. Uh, but I think it really sits at home on the rubber band, which I'm going to throw on right now. And as you can see here, the strap just comes right out. You push those two little pins, it comes right out, perfectly fit to the end, uh, which is very nice to see. You have that nice kind of lugless design here, or hidden lugless design, I should say. And um, yeah. You can get a better look at the inner workings of the movement now, as you can see. Obviously, it's not finished to a luxury, luxury standard because, you know, it's $150, but they do the best they can do. There's the custom-signed rotor for Ralph Christian. Um, yeah, just a pretty simple watch there. Uh, but let me throw it on this nice rubber band that was supplied with the watch, and we'll see how that looks. So everything is very seamless uh, putting this band on. As you can see, I just popped that right on with the quick release on the rubber band as well. You just push both in. You place it in there, and it fits perfectly. There's no issues whatsoever. Everything really conforms very nicely. As you can see, it perfectly curves to your wrist, the rubber band, which is very nice to see. Um, it's not rubber. I believe it's some type of silicone because it does attract a little bit of lint, but it's very comfortable. It's very supple, and it's very soft, and you do get a Ralph uh, Christian custom signed stainless steel buckle as well. So I'm going to go ahead and throw this on my wrist, and we'll see how that one looks. Now, obviously, I think this one fits my wrist a little bit better. Definitely really hugs the wrist very nicely. Uh, it's very, very comfortable. I must say, this thing is like really, really soft. There is uh, lines going up and down, very small lines, as you can see. Um, but yeah, I think for me, this would be the way to wear it. Um, it fits very nicely. It feels secure. Uh, it's a bit lighter as well. And it definitely plants itself a bit more firmer on my wrist. It feels a bit more secure. Uh, that's just from my point of view. Um, for this type of watch, I like it on the black uh, rubber band. For me, I think it looks pretty slick. Um, but yeah, both options are definitely very good depending on what you like. Now, in terms of loom, like I stated, there is loom on the hands themselves. Uh, it does glow green. It's not that bad. I mean, it's not really a loom, you know, dive watch with crazy loom or anything like that. It's more of a kind of casual, kind of fancy kind of watch maybe to dress up with, uh, dress down with as well. But overall, the quality of this watch is very good for the money. Um, the case cut finishing, there are no sharp edges or anything like that. Everything is finished uh, to a good to a good degree, I would say, for the money. Um, but yeah, it definitely also fits very comfortable on the wrist. And the movement has been running pretty good. Obviously, I can't hack the movement, but it feels like a pretty decent quality movement. I don't see any issues there for the price. Uh, you do get to see the movement with that nice kind of gold tone skeletonization, uh, which is always pretty cool. And yeah, just all not around, all around not a bad package for 150 bucks. I believe there's one for like 120. And there's always coupons on their website as well. So let me know what you think down in the comment section below as usual. This is Watch Addiction Watch Reviews with the Ralph Christian. Uh, maybe in the future, perhaps they can do like a straight non-skeletonized dial, maybe with like an NH35. I think that would be pretty cool as well. Um, but they're always coming out with some new watches, so definitely stay tuned. Perhaps I'll have another watch of theirs in the future. Um, yeah, overall, the quality of the watch is very good for the price. That's all I can say there. Let me know what you think down in the comment section below as usual. This is the new Ralph Christian Skeletonized Watch um, yeah, from Ralph Christian Watches. And definitely leave me a comment, subscribe to the channel, let me know what you think. We have a lot more reviews coming up, so definitely stay tuned, guys. I will see you real soon. Bye.